Hi, I'm James Brennan from Start Automy, and today I'm going to talk about a topic that really affects your bottom line, payment processing in PowerShell Pipeworks. PowerShell Pipeworks is a web framework built on top of Windows PowerShell, and today we're going to talk about how to actually manage to get paid with Stripe within PowerShell Pipeworks. Stripe is integrated in Pipeworks in a few ways. You can actually do direct payment processing. You can build a page over Stripe where you can use it as a function in other code. So we're going to start off with a direct charge. I can actually do this with the wonderfully named get paid commandlet. I can provide either a Stripe key, in this case I'm providing my test key, or I can provide a secure setting containing it. And I can provide a currency, card number, amount, expiration month, expiration year and CCB and there we go it'll charge a card in this case it charged the test card and I can go over here and refresh and there is my charge for ten dollars now if I wanted to actually get a little bit more advanced what I can do is I can take another built-in capability in Pipeworks, and that's the ability to talk over the phone via Twilio. And I can build a payment processing endpoint. And the way I can do this is I can actually create a small little function that takes my input, the amount, the card number, expiration month, and credit card verification code, and then I can use splatting to pass it down to the underlying function. And when I actually interact with this web service in the right way, it will create a web service that can respond to both website interaction or interaction from something like Twilio. When I pass the correct parameters, call SID and account SID, it asks me for the first of the individual positional parameters, the card number. If I was actually on the phone with this at the time, it would walk through positional parameter one, two, three, and four, and then then charge the card. But I think my favorite one is this. There's a module called Show UI. Both Show UI and Pipeworks are included in a module called Ice Pack. And Show UI is this great little toolkit for creating WPF user interfaces. Well, here's a credit card terminal in 55 lines of code. I'm going to go ahead and charge for $500 to the card number 4242442. Expiring in 11 2013 with the card number of 123, and off we go. There we go, I have a card charge. And again, back over into Stripe's dashboard. and my test account has been charged an additional $500. So that's it. That's how you can actually make a payment processor in 55 lines of code. That's how you can make a pay by phone in about the same. And that's how you can get paid with Stripe and PowerShell Pipeworks.